There are three methods of searching in the Oasis OPAC, as you see on the left. You can decide which search is the default. Here you see the standard search with a Google-like search box. Enter a word or phrase here and click the search button. As you can see, even if the word is misspelled, Oasis will provide a suggested spelling for your search. This brings you to the first results screen. This page shows basic information about each item, including call number and an icon that indicates the type of media. The availability box shows whether the item is on the shelf or unavailable, probably on loan, or is an electronic item, perhaps an ebook or a website. The cover images come from an add-on subscription to Syndetix Solutions, which provides enriched content about the item, including summaries and reviews. Patrons can use the book bag feature to collect a list of items they want to keep track of and bibliographies that can be printed, saved, or shared. They can also create multiple book bags. In all these cases, the format and the order of the list are easy to select and change. Your patrons can rate the items in the OPAC on a scale of 1 to 5, and they can add comments or reviews that are visible after a librarian has checked them. Clicking on the Details button brings up more information on an individual item, including its exact status. Blue highlighting indicates hyperlinks to allow the patron to follow subjects or authors. Another way of searching is the Enhanced Search which has drop-down menus offering several more fields in which to search. Terms can be combined with Boolean operators and browse buttons give access to the list of subjects, titles, and authors in the indexes. Patrons can create very specific search queries to fulfill their research needs. The third search option is the visual search, which comes with eight pre-configured queries and hierarchies, which can also be customized to fit your library. Using graphics from any number of sources, you can customize the hierarchies and queries and even create links to lead your patrons easily to the resources you know they want to find. Like the picture at the top of the page, buttons can be created to link to other databases or to other online sources of information. They can also be set to do the searches for the kinds of materials your patrons often look for or to support classroom projects or library events. Your patrons can log into the OPAC to perform any number of tasks for themselves, freeing you for other important library work. Besides being able to view their own transactions, current and historical, they can reserve items themselves, renew their own borrowed items, and even check out and check in their own materials. All of these features are, of course, subject to library policies and librarian choice, and they can be configured specifically for sets of patrons and items.